In today's video, we're going to be making seven types of mock-ups in Canva. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to get my latest uploads every week. First up, how to make an art print mock-up. Open up Canva and go to the search and type in empty wall. In Canva, you're going to find a bunch of empty wall type stock photos. Insert one you like. Then what we want to do is add some furniture and other things. Make sure that the filter is on for cutouts only. You're going to be able to insert any kind of furniture you want, but you can also make your own. Like I like this chair from this stock photo. So I'm going to insert this here, go to edit image and background remover. And now I'm just going to place the chair. You can add some more things like this vase with flowers, then upload and add your art. Search for a picture frame you like. I added this one, but it's too gold, so I'm going to make it less warm so that it matches better. And there you go, a custom photo mock-up for your art print. Second, let's look at different ways you can make t-shirt mock-ups in Canva. First thing to do is to upload your design to a canvas. Then click Edit Image, go to Smart Mock-ups, pick an image of someone in a t-shirt that you like, and it's going to apply that mock-up to that t-shirt. The next option is to create your own using stock photos. This is our stock photo. You add that to a canvas, then go to the elements, type in shirt and cutouts, and you'll find some shirts. You'll insert that and go ahead and edit the image to add a shadow. Once you have a shadow, you'll wanna place your design and you'll just place it where you like it and there you have an image. And lastly, the third option is to go into Canva and under Elements, search for a photo with someone wearing a white t-shirt. And if this doesn't go with your brand, go ahead and go to Edit Image and remove the background. Once the background's removed, you can add your own background color and then place your design on the t-shirt. Now, a very common mock-up is paper products, so I have a few different ways that you can mock up paper inside of Canva. You're going to want to locate some stock photos that have lots of space like this one and you can drag it over and it has lots of space in the middle. We create these stock photos on our website. Then you want to upload your digital item to your uploads and insert it onto the graphic. You may want to move the image around and find a good placement for your document. Then you're going to click on edit image and shadows and you're going to apply a shadow. I'm going to do this drop shadow. And you can see it added a shadow to the side. However, it's way too harsh for this photo. So we want to soften it up by clicking on the filters here and we want to adjust the and there you have it. You're ready to download. If you ever find a really good stock photo for your paper mockups, but you can't figure out how to get your design on the clipboard, let me show you an easy trick. So I have this little one page printable. I'm gonna go ahead and click here over to download. I'm gonna download it as a PNG, but with transparent background. Then I uploaded that to my upload and you can drag it right to your page. Now it looks like it's right there on that paper. One really engaging type of mock-up that you can make for your e-commerce shop or your Etsy store is a video mock-up. And you can use photos to do that right inside of Canva. Let me show you how. First thing what you want to do is insert a mock-up that you like. Then you're going to go click on record yourself and make sure your website or your digital product is open. And Canva is going to ask what you want to record and you're going to record your screen. The record button is going to pop up. You're going to hit record and then you're going to click over to your product or your website. Then as it's recording, you're going to scroll through your digital product. You're going to hit save and, and you're going to end up with a video for your mock-up. Download that as an MP4 and share. One common mock-up is a phone or a mobile device. And you might find it difficult if you're trying to put a mock-up into a photo and this is going to show you how to do that. This is how you're going to insert something in that phone. In Canva you're going to type photo phone holder. You're going to grab this item and place it over the top. 
Then drag whatever you want into the phone. So now let's look at how to make a mock-up on a mug. So if I had this quote, you can come over to edit image and go to smart mock-ups. And there's this mug here. And it applied that design to the mug. And I did that one as well. In addition to that, we have a ton of mock-ups that you can get on our website. You can also go to Canva and go to cutouts only on the element where you can kind of dress up the photo. You can use shadows too. And lastly, if you're looking to create a mock-up that's unique that no one's ever seen before, you can actually create custom photos for your mock-ups. Let me show you how. Open up Canva and place your brand color. Search up a device frame you want to use. Place that frame. Search up some drop shadows and place the drop shadow underneath, creating like a table. Now what we want to do is put more things on this table. I'm going to search up cup, but what we want to do is go here and make sure cutouts are provided only. And you'll get these. I found this one and it comes with a shadow, which is nice. And you can add some other things like clipboard cutouts and pencil cutouts. But if you don't like the table look, you can create a flat lay type using cutouts as well, and it would look like this. And this is made with all cutouts found on Canva. Now that you've learned everything you can in this video, you're ready to move on to the next step. So I've put together this free resource for you to help you with that, and you can grab it right below this video.